He's coming back. We know that 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 He's coming back. We It seems, yeah, I know it's gonna be okay. Yeah. It doesn't scare me, it's temporary. There's something better we got forever. And it won't be long, cause we know our help is on the way. The way. So keep your head up. Jesus is coming back, Jesus is coming back. So don't you give up. Stay awake, cause nobody knows the day or time. Mm. The trumpet's gonna blow and the skies are gonna open wide. Oh yeah, he's coming for us, just like he told us. It's been a long way, but it's a new day, and we're gonna sing hallelujah when the king arrives. Oh, you know you gotta keep your head up. trust in you and we follow hard after you Lord yeah thank you Jesus yeah.
after you That's why it's easy to follow you, Lord, because we trust you. Thank you, Jesus. I'm calling on the God of Jacob, whose love endures through generations. I know that you will keep your covenant. I'm calling on the God of Moses, the one who opened up the ocean. I need you now to do the same thing for me.
heard your children then you hear your children now you are the same god yeah you are the same god you answered prayers back then and you will answer now you are the same god you are the same god you were providing you are providing now. You are the same God. Yes, you are. You are yes, the you same are. God. You moved in power then. God moved in power now. You are the same God. You are the same God. You are a healer then. You are a healer.
restored you brought back to us come on sing that with me tonight oh victory you have won Oh, 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We bless you. We give you glory, honor, and praise. Lord Jesus, we declare that you are the King of kings and the Lord of lords. We bless you. We give you glory in the mighty name that's above every name. That's right. Just go ahead and bless him like that. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for sending Jesus to the earth to be born for us, live for us, die for us, and now he is raised for us. And Lord Jesus, we thank you that you ever lived to make intercession for us. We bless you in the mighty name, your mighty name, the name of Jesus. Father, we also thank you for the Holy Ghost, for his ministry, how he is, he is now able to move in and take up residence within us, working through us to accomplish your will and purpose. We bless you. We give you glory in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. That's right. Just go ahead and bless the Lord like that. Thank you, Lord Jesus. We're so thankful for all that you have done and are doing, will continue to, continue to do. We know that you're faithful. Thank you, Heavenly Father. You watch over your word to perform it. Glory to God. It is wonderful to be here tonight. Just go ahead and throw your hands up in the air. Bless him. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Glory to the King. God is good. Okay, so I'm going to ask you before you're seated, if you would, just look around a bit, see if it's possible to find somebody that you have not greeted yet tonight. Love and bless on them and tell them it's a great thing you're here tonight and then have a seat. today or online or here in person we are so glad that you are here we would love to meet you in person so we can love on you and get some information to you and things like that and just just put a face to a name you know we love our people amen and we love serving together which is what the announcements are about tonight so pay attention so here we go on our website faithlandmarks.org um, we have our next on-site new members class is this Sunday June 9th in the Hall of Miracles Membership classes are also online as well. So if you aren't able to make it, you also have an option of being there online. We also have job openings and there's some new positions available. We have a full-time team lead assistant. We also have full-time or part-time, excuse me, facilities with carpentry skills and full-time media technician. So you know anyone that has that skill set or if you yourself have that skill set, just make sure that you are, again, um, coming onto the website, which is faithlandmarks.org. And if, any, if anything that's announced tonight like kind of piques your interest or the Holy Spirit's kind of pulling on your heart and saying, hey, let's, let's go on this adventure together, amen. You can go ahead, you can go ahead and just, um, you'll find all this information again on faithlandmarks.org, amen. We also have Bible reading sheets available for the month of June. We just started June. And there's a wonderful Bible blurb on the front, take inventory. The message last Sunday was fantastic. I went back and listened to it three times myself. So <laughs> um, I'm just saying, like, you, you don't want to miss out. The Holy Spirit is definitely talking. He has something for you. And, man, you don't want to miss out on that, right? No. So I'm sorry. Yes, so we have our, our sanctuary attendants, and they have these available for you. Amen, amen. Amen. And then we also have our offering envelopes as well for tithing and giving. Amen. I tell you, these sanctuary attendants, they are on it. They flipped that card so fast. That was amazing. Praise God. <laughs> 
Praise God. And we also have, um, yes, giving online is an option as well. Same website, faithlandmarks.org, or you can give by text. Amen. But either way, do not miss your opportunity to, you know, get yourself into, you know, a really solid church and tithe and just be a part of this move that God is doing in this place. Amen. Amen. Finish Line Summer Camp has started. It's up and running. I've been talking to some of the workers and the kids are all already abuzz about the things that are coming up later in the summer. So if you know a family or maybe have some, you know, cousins, nieces, nephews, who knows, little tiny friends that you know that would love to be a part of such a wonderful program, you should definitely, you know, offer Finish Line Summer Camp, amen? And you can sign up online, it's still open. And again, VBS is also coming up as well, but I'll, I'll tackle that later, but you don't wanna miss that. But let me go in order. And then we have summer outreach as well. We have flyers with this year's summer outreach schedule. They are out on the tables um, in the sanctuary, brightly colored. We will need a lot of hands um, for these events. And we believe in God that that's gonna be met as well. We are a faithful church. We always rise to the occasion to serve, amen. So this is gonna be really good. Um, I bumped into a friend upstairs. She said, you can, come, you can sign for one or you can sign for all. But you know, just make sure that you are not missing this opportunity to get your hands you know, on the plow, you know, moving the kingdom forward, getting people saved, amen. And being a part of this awesome outreach, amen. Um, and the dates and things are on there as well. It's running from June 22nd. We have June 24th, June 29th, and July 22nd. The details are on those flyers out in the hallway. Amen. CDC graduation, they have been working so hard. CDC is our child development um, center. Our little friends have been like learning their like alphabets and learning their numbers and they cannot wait to show you how much they know. <laughs> And they cannot wait to, you know, to take pictures and meet all of this large family that we've been talking about, amen? So guess what? You're all invited. You can all come. It's happening this Friday, June 7th, 2024, this year, at 7 p.m. And you just don't want to miss this opportunity. This is a really good opportunity to just see like, how, how it works. You know, they go through CDC, they go into FLA, and they come out. You know, we just had a um, graduation celebration for our senior. It was amazing. She has opportunities that have opened up to her. So, I mean, this whole, the Holy Spirit is all throughout this thing. You don't want to miss this opportunity. So, you should definitely come out and support. Amen. VBS registration is open. Vacation Bible School, we've been having, like, you know, some videos playing the sanctuary and things like that. It is open, so make sure to register online at faithlandmarks.org. You don't want to miss that. We also have our Faith Landmark Skills Center. Upcoming classes will be the real estate class. You can learn all the ins and outs of real estate. Come learn from a licensed real estate agent. So this is not some YouTuber, you know, that kind of is like, I know three things, I'm gonna teach a class. This is a licensed real estate, <laughs> real estate person, amen. So this is, this is good stuff, you know? This is good stuff. So, licensed real estate agent, the class will be this Friday, June 7th in the youth building. So you don't wanna miss that. And then we also have another class, the Guide to Will and Trust class. Learn about will and trust, leave your legacy behind. Join us this Friday, June 7th in the youth building. Okay. Ladies fellowship. I was just talking to someone about this. We are starting early. Amen. We are, <laughs> we are in early June and we're talking about our Christmas trip to Lancaster, which is always a blast. Amen. Um, we, they will be going, we, be, we will be going to see the Daniel, Daniel play at Sight and Sound Theater. They were clapping before I even got it out. You know, they're excited. And then we have dinner at Miller's and Joa and Amish tour, the biblical tabernacle experience and shopping. I love shopping. It should be its own category <laughs> and all things. So you don't want to miss this, especially if you're a lady. And, and you know, and as, as well, if you have friends, most ladies have like pools of friends, you know, invite them all. Tell them to come on out, you know, tell them to get their registration, you know, information ready and come on out so they can, you know, be a part of, you know, Christian fellowship and have a really good time. Amen? Amen. That, the date of that trip, excuse me, will be December 5th and 6th. Registration, again, is now open, so don't miss that. Young adults, young adults, excuse me, join us Friday, June 21st at 6.30 p.m. for a game or two of laser tag at Mission Laser RVA followed by ice cream at Cold Stone Creamery. Register to let us know who to expect and you will pay at the door per game, okay? So thank you for coming out tonight. We are so glad that you're here. And I'm sorry, one last thing with two things. Um, for our new friends, we have these connect cards. If you are interested in one, um, we are very good you know, at you know, communicating the things that are happening in this church. 
and all of the ins and outs, you know, of you know different you know conferences and just different events. So if you want that information, we definitely encourage you picking one up. If you're missing this and you're out in the hallways, you can pick one up at the tables out in the hallways as well. And last but certainly not least, prayer request cards. We have a fantastic prayer team. Um, they've actually increased their meeting times so that everyone can come in and pray. So there's information for that as well out there in the hallways. But if you're in need of prayer or just a connection point of someone to believe, you know, God with you, those are also available as well. We have our awesome sanctuary attendants and they're always ready to hand those out to you as well. Amen. So again, thank you for coming out tonight. We love you and enjoy the service. Hallelujah. Thank you. Glory to God. The Lord is good. Okay. Going to ask you if you do it again, please uh, stand to your feet. Thank you, Lord Jesus. It is wonderful to be here tonight. Glory to God. The Lord is good. Okay. Going to ask you if you would just go ahead and bless the Lord. Oh, Lord, we bless you. We thank you. Thank you for your tangible presence on us and in this room in the mighty name of Jesus. Lord Jesus, you said where two or three of us are gathered together, you would be there in our midst. And so we know that you're here tonight. We bless you and we give you glory in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. God is good. Okay, going to ask you to do it again. This time I'm going to ask you to find five people that you have not yet greeted. Love and bless on those five people. Tell them it's a great thing you're here tonight and then have a seat. God is good. I, I'm going to read uh, some verses to you, some things that Jesus taught about money. Okay? So uh, it, it begins actually in Matthew chapter 6, verse 19. Jesus said, Lay not up for yourselves treasures upon earth where moth and rust doth corrupt and where thieves break through and steal. So your savings plan, you need to make sure that you're a tither and a giver and uh Verse 20 is what will happen. But lay up for yourselves treasures in heaven where neither moth nor rust doth corrupt and where thieves do not break through nor steal. For where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Amen. Glory to God. God is good. Hallelujah. Now, uh, I, I, I've, I've told you this many times, but I'll tell you to it again, tell it to you again. This uh, passage that where Jesus is talking about money, he's uh, guiding us spiritually to see God as our source. Now, you know, the U.S. economy, the U.S. dollar, none of that is mentioned here. In fact, it, it'll be gone. It, it wasn't, uh, yeah, it, it'll be gone when God's done with it. Don't get all freaked out just because I said that. <laughs> Everything that you know about the world system will be gone when Jesus comes back. We were just singing about that. Including us. Yeah, including us. That's right. We're going to be lifted out of here. <laughs> Glory to God. Okay. Glory to God. So, and what he's going to do in the meantime, because he's promised to do this, he's promised to minister to you financially with abundance. If, particularly if, if you're a tither or a giver, you have give, uh, tithing privileges. Glory to God. Okay, 
So I'm going to ask you if you uh, came into the room tonight and you were unable to uh, get your hand on one of these envelopes and yet you say, I would like to have one of those for my offering tonight. If you uh, need that one, it, just hold it up before uh, God like that. Hold your hand up if you would. <laughs> Praise you, Jesus. Sure is quiet in this Christian house. Hallelujah. Okay. I'm going to ask you if you would please stand to your feet, uh, and you might still be working on your offering, but whatever form it's in, if you would just hold it up before God like this with me, and say this with me, Heavenly Father, you're good for your word, your promises are true, you said that we should prove you in our tithing. Thank you, Father, for opening the windows of heaven pouring us out a blessing into our lives. We bless you and we thank you for abundance being poured out and working in our lives in the name of Jesus. Yes, Father, you are good for your word and we bless you in Jesus' name, amen. 